Okay, here we are at the dispatcher's desk, and Michelle has uh, has described all the information that prepared in order to uh, to run the railroad, to manage the timetable and produce the timetable. That timetable, as Michelle uh, has said, is normally used by mainly by the dispatcher. The crews are working on an occupancy, uh, a track occupancy basis. So, Michelle, could you describe how the dispatcher functions and how he okay. uses the computer, his clock, and so on? Okay, uh, I've used, uh, actually I'm using the JMRI uh, editing uh, capability uh, to track the, uh, the trains en route, okay? So, our train, 303 102 here that's left, so uh, you had a green light if you remember, so the green light can be given here. How does the dispatcher actually set that signal? This is JMRI software, so you, yes, you've yes. got to click on the screen, yeah, is that all it, it yeah, is? That's it, exactly, see, red now, green, so uh, you, have to, uh, you have to have the, uh, the lens uh, controller uh, decoder. It goes know? through the DCC goes through interface. DCC, so, yeah, exactly, Go goes through the DCC interface and uh, the dispatcher can, and in the actual on the prototype that's the only signal there is because eh? that's the, the the signal that takes you from the main line that goes from the Rouse's Point to Albany to the Adirondack branch so that's the only junction you know so I'm legit this way <laughs> right. I don't have to signal the whole the whole layout you know it's dark territory it's dark territory so once the so the 303 has been going all along, eh? like you know, you can see he's been tracked like this all along, and you know he's been like in North Creek, remember? And now we went through North River up on the uh, milepost 114, and uh, he's up in the National Lead Sanford Lake, remember? He called from milepost 174, and he's here right now. You know, he's at the uh, the uh, 204, which is around here. Okay, so there's my train now. So this way, the dispatcher follows all the other trains. Okay, so I know that all my other trains are in Saratoga. See, that's all their numbers. NL1, NL3, you know, the, the passenger trains and so on. So everything's there. All my extras are over here. So when a, a new train gets in, uh, I can send an extra dimensional. Sometimes I, I, I pre plan these. Eh? They're ready to go either in Saratoga or in North Creek or somewhere. Then I send an operator. Pre-planned means staged. Staged, yes. And 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 pre-planned in the in, in, on our famous graph there. Oh yes. Yeah. So you found yeah. an opening in the timetable. I know where I can diagram. slot this guy. You know, <laughs> you know. So the, so the, it's oblivious to the operators, but we know that it will fit, you know. And the dispatcher knows. Yeah, the, the, the dispatcher knows and... Uh, he, he How does the dispatcher control the clock? Ah, uh, right here. Okay, there's the clock and you see this, if you can closer, you see your ratios, eh? There's a 6 to 1 ratio. So now we're at 11 o'clock in the morning, eh? We left at 6.30 if you remember. And he can, uh, he sets the clock on by running here or off by flipping down or you can just hold it you know for a while or you can change the speed eh? you can go faster uh, 5 to 1, 8 to 1, 10 to 1, 12 to 1 and so on so is this, this a commercial product Michel? yes it is and it's a uh, I think I've got it on the slide there it's a GSL okay. uh, and you can write it down and uh, very interesting yes uh, fantastic little tool eh? because mm -hmm. the dispatcher here has a sense Norm could tell you this if he was here he, he knows the operators okay so he, he runs this railroad with uh, a sense of the people a knowledge of the uh, equipment capabilities and uh, a knowledge of the uh, the uh, railroad uh, and the timetable and the timetable okay because one thing we forgot to mention all along is that once we've done all this testing, like I've plugged it in and done a timetable, I get it checked by the dispatcher. I get him an actual train sheet, and for about three or four sessions, all the OS calls that come in are reported on the train sheet. So I know after the session, how close 
My schedule is the reality. And if it's not close, and you if can it's not close, it. we can change it. Remember, we had the yes. ability to move the trains around and stuff. And uh, surprisingly, uh, in the ideal conditions, you know, like we haven't had a major derailment or or uh, uh, any uh, other problem, or we've got the right operators at the right place, like, like <laughs> Norm likes to say, you know. It says put Chris in North Creek and put Andreas in Ta House and. It's a cozy evening, <laughs> you know. <laughs> like, you know. So uh, if we do that, then uh, uh, it's funny, but the, the whole thing works. It's like the orchestra is singing, you know. Like uh, it's perfect.